name is Marjorie Thomas. I'm the Education Coordinator at the Chattahoochee River National Recreation Area, which is a unit within the Park Service. The Chattahoochee River was designated a National Recreation Area in 1978, and luckily people had vision to want to protect the water quality, to protect the river itself because um, Atlanta was growing, we needed green spaces, um, we needed clean water. We wanted to also protect the geologic features. We have a lot of cultural and historic resources as well, which brings us to Hyde Farm. The cabin was built um, somewhere in the 1840s and they occupied the cabin at that time. Anyway, in the early 1900s, the Hyde family started sharecropping on this land with the Powers family. When all the Powers family deceased that the Hydes were working with, um, the land was actually put up, or in the cabin, were put up for foreclosure. Bought, they were taken over by the bank. The Hyde family was able to purchase the property and um, then began living in the house in the 20s. And uh, the cabin was actually lived in and by members of the Hyde family until 2004 when the last brother, um, J.C. Hyde, died. The well is where they always got their water. Um, and it still works today. We are targeting second and eighth grade this year for educational field trips, and it's to teach them. There'll be a component about Native Americans because we know that the Native Americans were here. There'll be a component about farming life back in, you know, in the 19th century, as well as what Alex has been working on. I'm Alex Alvarez, a uh, science teacher at South Cobb's Academy of Research and Medical Science Magnet Program. We're looking at um, developing a teacher packet to uh, go along with the, the field trip opportunity that uh, the Cobb County students are uh, looking at starting in the fall, coming out, and uh, you can hear the construction in the background where they're putting in parking lots and have a visitor center um, back there. One of the things I was looking at um, with GIFT this summer is expanding my knowledge again as I'm taking on an AP Environmental Science um, class at the school, starting something new. And I looked at areas that I needed to know more about, like water quality and conservation, and I thought this would be the perfect match. We started off looking at the physical science aspect, since it's the eighth grade study, and then it also ties in the simple machine science with second graders, um, not as directly, but as far as their standards, a little, not as quite as detailed as eighth grade. We found a link there, and we've also found links to social studies and economics and English. Um, this is really a jewel, and um... Hopefully, hopefully everybody will see the benefits of, of Hyde Farm.